All right, Driftwood here. Today we're taking a look at the Tulium Beast. All right, so just a little bit over a year ago, we picked up this Tulium after watching the review. So far, I haven't had any major issues with the Tulium. The one thing I do have to make a gripe about is the clamps. That's right, the ground clamp. I've had to rebuild this thing. It falls apart on me all the time. I finally said, hey, you know what? No more. That's right. And then we've got the stinger. Now, this thing is about as much of a piece of crap as what comes out of my dog's butt. So I was like, you know what? Pfft, no more. Goodbye. But we did upgrade. That's right. We went to the local country store out in Milton Freewater here in Eastern Oregon, and we picked up this bad boy. Look at the teeth on her. Arr, 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 arr. She's going to get a good... And we also got this. Now, we need a new good ground clamp, so we went all the way in with the big brass 200 amp. This is going to make a huge deal and a massive difference in the way that things are getting welded. Now, I've got a good ground. Now, I've got a good stinger. Now, I've just got to go weld. So, all in all, the Tulium is a gold beast. She holds her weight. She does the job. And you know what? for putting up 40 posts welding all these custom brackets we're talking thousands and thousands and thousands of welds and hours and hours. we're talking i don't know probably a thousand hours of welding and she's still working great worth the 79 dollars and that is a tulium driftwood welding box review don't forget to subscribe and like come back and check out great horn builds and also check out close encounters with driftwood we've got a doozy coming up soon don't forget to look up, keep building.